this tariff guy has been going on and on on twitter about you know foundational black american i'm just very very perplexed <laughs> Hi guys oh my god it has been such a long time like such a long time not picking up my camera my last vlog was about ending of last year and today is 27th of january am i correct okay yeah today's 27th of january um uh, yeah guys i missed vlogging and um today um i'm trying to get back to creating resuming fully uh as a content creator my hands are painting me i need to let me put my tripod on and put my camera on my table so that I can talk much better. Yeah. Guys, so it took me a while to set up my tripod on the table. Like, hey, you've only been away for like three weeks and you've forgotten how to like set up your tripod properly. Anyhow, so while I was setting it up, I got a comment on YouTube, you know, someone asking me, when am I going to be back on YouTube? I posted on Instagram yesterday on my story. So, um... You're gonna see i've seen this video in february literally i wanted to come back in february but i didn't want to come back and just you know if i knew i knew that you know if i decide to start creating february i would have you know that whole rush of wanting to be back to you know how things were so i said let me come back last week in january i'll sort out emails because the major thing i have sort out is emails like almost every other day i got an email for a collaboration um, I also had issues with my email, so I couldn't set up an out-of-office email, but I just could not deal with replying. Um, so, for me, <laughs> that's like my priority right now, sort out those emails. I've been on this Twitter space all morning, and I'm so happy I got myself to leave because it was so hard for me to leave. So, this Tariq guy has been going on and on on Twitter about, you know, foundational black American um and talking about african americans coming in like migrating to like take their jobs i'm just very very perplexed because i honestly felt like you know what's this division between black people was this oh i'm one kind of black or oh, you're another kind of black like what's all this division between us so different people have come on the space to, like air their views and most people that don't align with him he has been shutting them off like he would just mute them and kick them off and saying some like rude things as well so I, I think i don't have a problem with two people not agreeing on something we're human beings but you can at least be respectful to other people on the space so don't say some things don't cut people off when people are talking let them talk simple you created a space for people to air their views why are you now shutting them off when they don't align with you? Like, if you want to speak alone, you should have just done this as a podcast instead of coming, you know, making it a Twitter space. Anyhow, that aside, um, yeah, I need to plug my my um, battery. Guys, I lost one of my batteries. I think it was last year. So now I'm down to two camera batteries instead of three like I had before. But I'm going to try my best to make it work regardless. Let me plug it. Yes, yeah, so today I have to prep my laptop. My system has been off, like my MacBook has been off, like during the break. If I put it up, it's only because I want to do something. Um, maybe I need a document from there because I was doing some applications during my break, or I want to watch movies. So my desktop is currently facing my bed. Yeah, and um, now it's like I just play a movie close my laptop it's a bigger screen and then i lay down my bed boy it has been enjoyment during this period um so today i have to step out i want to i want to check out a co-working space because i want to be going to a co-working space um one because of meetings with my pa so we're going to be meeting once in a week for now um in case i you know there's no power at home i can easily just go there to work also being out i feel like i'll accomplish more if I'm outside and I'll stop walking to the fridge every two minutes. <laughs> Who else is guilty of that? So I want to get a space to, you know, just go and work. So I want to check out. There are two places I have here in Yaba. If the first one is good, because I think that one is closer to me, I won't bother with the second one. But if I'm not, if I'm not cool with like the first one, then I'm going to go to the second one. I also want to go to where do i want to go to again yeah i also want to get to mini so i need to get the blade that i used to 
shave my face um i have a video on that and if you guys want to check out you know my routine for shaving my face so i'm gonna be back to like doing makeup and i need my face to be smooth so my makeup can really stay on my face i have a wedding this weekend as well so i really want you know to let the makeup be on my face properly yes yeah, so then i also need to i got new pampas grass so i want to open that up now and add it to my pampas grass so that is it over there my problem with the old one is that i feel like it's getting it's skinny so it's now looking very little so i just wanted to make it fuller so that can also help to like with my background and all of that so i'm gonna open it up and then i would show you guys so this is the pampas grass i got it from the same people i got the first ones from so that's my friend's page minimalist lagos so um i know that if you've been following me and you watch my room tour um i got lots of questions because i tagged her page there and people said well they couldn't find her page and all well instagram took down her page and you know she's yet to bring it back but i'm going to ask her if she's comfortable with me sharing her personal page if she is and she says yes i'm going to put it up on the screen so let me just tear it off. I got a total of three. Yes, I got three. So with these ones now, it's making it five. So these are how they are. I don't know, but they look a little, they look different, right? Um, yeah, they look different, definitely. And there's a lot of shedding from this particular one. But I'm hoping that with time, maybe to open up. Because these ones were uptight too when I got them. Did I just say uptight? Like they were together, you guys get the vibe, but yeah. I feel like these ones too are fuller, but you know, let's put them inside and see how they look. Okay. They are shorter though, it's definitely from the stick, the length of the stick. I'll look for ways to bring these ones up a little bit. Sorry guys, it's not been at the edge since, but yeah, this is where we have the combination of the three of them. This thing is shedding a lot. Like I have... Maybe it's just because it's new. I pray so because if this is going to be, I'm going to have to be sweeping my room every day. This is it. I don't know. It doesn't look like the worst, but I don't like the height difference. That's the only thing I don't like because this is like tall, tall, and this is tall. And then this is... So it's either I reduce these ones, maybe cut the stick because these ones are longer, definitely. Or I just um, find a way to raise these ones up. Anyone. Yeah. Driving me wild, you driving me so crazy. Got me acting out, got me trying to stay sober. Me trying to stay sober. Wanted to your love, and I'm out here hungover. You made me wanna take you to London, Paris. Times were cherished. No comparing to you. Guys, so I'm done with like stuff I had to do at home. I want to bathe to go out, but I need to first of all check. I'm trying to check my to-do list with my life planner. Okay, if you guys haven't shopped my planner, you know what to do. The link is in the description box and it's undated, so it's pretty good. Um, so even if you buy it in March, you can simply just start from the beginning because you call the shots on what month it is. It's not. It's very flexible that's one thing i love about the planner that's like my favorite thing about the planner yeah so um i'm trying to check my to-do list of yesterday to know if there's anything that i dragged into today and okay i did this yesterday i can cross this out um so i need to check the co-working space i need to message my hrd comes i'm still dealing with some school stuff <laughs> But like it's like gonna be sorted out soon yeah i need to send a design to somebody to print for me i need to send reply one of my emails because today's the deadline it is 27th right yeah today's the deadline so hmm. i'm gonna bait that i'll come to my system to reply with emails because right now my head is not even thinking straight to be honest guys so i'm about to live in the house no, my earring fell. Okay. All right. Let's get into shoes. Enter. Hey, how I'm stepping out now. I have a couple of things put in my bag. Uh, my wallet, my card, 
I can't it's always out of my wallet like I don't have a wallet I don't know I feel better keeping it in bags back of my phone than inside my purse I don't know why it's just a habit um, my earbuds um, I misplaced my airpods last year and my dad gave me these ones I don't know if I ever mentioned that in any of my vlogs last year but he gave me this one that was like the cutest thing because this thing has really really helped me the audio of my macbook at the inbuilt mic is bad so when I'm having my meetings there's honestly nothing I can do to make somebody hear me if I don't use um, external devices like uh, the airpods airpods yeah i need to use one of those things before uh, anybody can hear me in my meetings i don't know if i have any other thing to carry because i'm just going to check out a co-working space and then buy something so there's no need for me to carry any other thing yeah so i think we can be on our way my loves <laughs> Guys, so I'm done now. I checked out the space. I couldn't really make so many videos because there are people there. And I don't want to put my camera into the space too. Because I mean, I came there to work. So, I'm going to go and buy a couple of things. And I'll be on my way. Hey guys, so I'm back home. Guys, don't go outside. Like, don't go outside, kids. It is hot outside and it's very, very dusty as well. Um, so I was able to get the things that I wanted to get. I also got things to cook tomorrow. <sighs> after cook, Maltina is like the best thing to drink after a long day. So let me show you guys my best buy. <laughs> it was impulse because um, I ended up in Yaba Market. Don't ask me how I got there because I know that was not part of my agenda for the day. But where the place I wanted to get the razor for to shave my face, yes, it's in the mall is in Yaba Market. So that's where I went to instead of going to Miniso. Yeah, so... Um, on my way out of the market, I spotted it with my eyes. I said, no, I can't leave you. I have to stop to get you. So I've always wanted an oversized blazer, like like long and big blazer. I'm trying to place my camera on my tripod. Sorry, shaking. So let me show you guys. It's so big. It's so massive. So I got this blazer on my way out of the market. This one was, I got this one for 2000 and I think it's like a good buy. Okay, I did try to price it for less, but the guy wasn't at green and I just wanted him to. I really wanted the jacket and I just felt like, oh, okay, what the heck? It's not like I don't have the money, like I had 2K on me. Um, let me just get it. So this is how the blazer is. Guys, I've always wanted something like this. It's, I don't know if I should call this a blazer or a coat, but it's quite a long blazer because I don't think it classifies as a coat, but this is so pretty. I had a styling video I wanted to do and I needed a black blazer. So I'm happy I was able to get one. I was going to ask um, my friend that helps me go to the market to shop to help me find one. But since I was in the market and I spotted this one, I'm like, oh, let me just get it now instead of having to message her and wait for a couple of days to get it. So I like it. He had other ones that I tried another one on in the market. That one was shorter than this, but it was also a big size. Um, that one was about... I think he's, he gave me last price for that one for one five. Um, I was crazy about this one, so I just decided to go for only one. I don't need two. I don't wear blazers often. It's just because of like styling videos and content, and maybe.
going out once in a while and maybe eventually when I travel this would be very very helpful yeah so but yeah this is actually very massive and cheapest <laughs> only if you wear something fitted inside like a bodycon like a bodysuit like i'm wearing now or you wear um, a fitted dress maybe i should do a styling video here on youtube on styling like long blazers like this that would sell right anyhow so i have a consultation in about 20 minutes yes in about 20 minutes and i have work stuff to get to so i'll sort that out at night or in the evening um i'm gonna do my face stuff i'm gonna shave my face prep to film if i do everything on time i should be able to film overnight i'm gonna be filming only at night only at night like that's my new plan for this year i'm gonna be filming only at night to be honest because i can't deal with noise during the daytime distractions inconsistent electricity no, I just can't deal with it. So I'll film only at night going forward. You guys will most likely take note of it in my background when I'm going. When I'm filming content, unless I'm trying to tell a story that has to do with something happening in the daytime, then that's when I'll film in the daytime. Other than that, this curtain ain't going to be bringing in lights during my videos. Yeah, so let me get to that. Okay, itchy with the blazer. Hey. Martina needs to sign me so <laughs> Hey guys, so it's time for me to do my facials now. Um, I need to get my hair up. I want it away from my face. Anything that requires cutting. Hmm. And my hair. Because, I mean, I'm going to be using a razor. Let me just put my hair away. Even though it's braids, but... Hmm. Guys. Anyhow, that may be story from that day. But I mistakenly, <laughs> ending of last year, cut chunk of my hair. Like, if I lose my hair, like, I think around here... There's one here that the hair stops about here. It's that bad. It's, it's honestly that bad. So I just want to be careful. And of course, um, I don't want my um, hair getting in the way. Yes, then I need to wash my face too. So I think I'm going to quickly wash my face. That's like the first step. Yeah. Guys, so I'm washing my face now. I'm using the For Real rather, Luna Mini 2. Let me see if my camera is going to focus on it. Yep, so this is how it is. If you're hearing any vibrating sound, um, it's coming from me. So it literally just um, does that and helps with me working the product around my face. So I'm going to do this for about a minute. Okay, let me flip the screen so you guys can see my cute Another face. end of the night, here I am by your side again. I couldn't hide what I've been keeping inside So I tried to deny it again Until night feels different Maybe something is different in the air Can't wait another minute The anticipation getting to be too much to bear Do you want Hey guys so i'm done now um i'm using the hydrating mask from bolden um i love this mask so much i'm really praying that you know i pray it doesn't finish because i know i'm gonna have to restock and it's quite on the high side but i really love it it's gentle never felt a pain tingle anything with this mask um other products that i use i wash my face using asm beauty gel face wash 
then um, the oil I use is from soybean that is before shaving my face yes yeah, so I'm done my skin feels amazing no pain at all I didn't cut myself once again I've actually never cut myself yeah so right now I'm gonna let the mask get into my skin I'm gonna prep to film and all but that's pretty much it for today I will see you guys tomorrow Bye. hey guys good morning it's actually afternoon on Friday it's Friday afternoon um so hmm, there has not been lights you no know, I said I wanted to film last night there was no lights like shortly after I finished doing my facials light went and um, it didn't come back at all currently this is Jen but I want to go about my activities for today anyhow I'm sad that I couldn't film but I'm hoping that this night I would be able to record yeah so the stamp for my business came um, I'm so so happy I want to show you guys how it looks like guys I've been looking for someone to make stamp for my business since since I started it but I couldn't get anyone in Nigeria I finally found someone and I just got the stamp so I'm gonna show you guys how it looks so you guys can also see why I'm so excited about it so this is how the stamp is okay let me quickly open it up so my business name is there oh, yep that's for sale by YY so it's pretty much very easy to use I'm gonna be using it to stamp bags like this one here as well as boxes and any other thing I'm gonna be using for packaging so I'm gonna place it here I have to be sure that it's the middle and then I'm gonna press release and voila my logo is there I'm so so excited I have a couple of orders to pack out right now so that's what I want to get to Talking about your family till we fall asleep. I don't like that you know my order when we're out to eat and you pay for me. Cause I don't wanna be someone loving, loving, looking dumb. But you don't care. You go on and make me feel things that I don't wanna feel. So I get scared every time you That perfect smile And I don't like All the compliments you're always giving me Is this even real? Cause I don't wanna be that girl Falling hard and getting hurt But you don't care Hey guys, so I'm done cooking now. Hmm. Man, this food is actually not bad. Definitely not something I'm used to though. Like the sauce is like the best part of it because 
it just gives extra spice to it because left to me i won't eat this much potatoes alone i can't do that i'm so so tired um i mean i've been in the kitchen for quite a while and i was out before so i'm like quite tired i just want to eat after eating i'm going to bathe come back to my laptop to reply more emails before i go to bed i sleep early because i have a meeting tomorrow as i have this deal that just came my way and it's so so beautiful like i'll probably let you guys know if i can talk about it but man like you know when you've listed some people as a dream brand you want to work with and it's finally happening to you and um it's just so amazing like it's so i love my journey so much because so many times things i've prayed for and wished for that i couldn't get when i wanted them they came back to me without me even stressing i didn't have to write a pitch i didn't have to sell myself nothing um that was a beautiful thing of working hard and being consistent yeah so i'm very tired i'm literally out of breath to be honest i need to bathe get ready for the wedding tomorrow i have a wedding i'm gonna go for the wedding in the afternoon yeah so i think that's it for this video um let me know if you're gonna be trying my recipe <laughs> you're gonna be trying my recipe um let me know if you if you tried it let me know how it came out okay um pretty much straightforward i didn't do anything special i used milk for the with the butter for the mashed potatoes and that's it so i just pray that the other people in this house my family members would actually like it if not i'm toast because it's me that's going to eat all of this and what's left in the pot too yeah so guys thank you so much for watching this video my first vlog of the year i love you guys so much you know expect more content definitely more content this year more vlogs okay thank you thank you thank you subscribe if you haven't and i'll see you guys in my next one bye